What up, YouTube? This is the soul, and I'm back. Hey, um, wanted to talk to you guys that uh, that be snoring, and you, you you're thinking about getting this Z Quiet, or the guys that already have it in their mouth. Hey, man, take that thing. If you already have it, take it out of your mouth now. Take it out of your mouth and throw that thing away. And the Z Quiet, that mouthpiece, all of them. I don't give a I don't give a dang which ones it are. They do not work. The reason they don't work is because they just don't work. The product is no good. Now, the bad thing about using the Z-Quiet or the mouthpiece is that after a couple of years, it's going to offset your jaw because when, they, when you buy the mouthpiece, they tell you to push your jaw forward and then bite down. That's very uncomfortable. I don't know how many people sleep with their jaw pushed out, but it, it ain't comfortable. And it's going to offset your mouth and you're going to have a lisp. And it's going to cost a lot of money to get your mouth set back. So I'm telling you right now, don't do the mouthpiece. If, you, if you're a back, if you're the type of person that sleeps on your back and you don't really move at night, then yes, the machine is perfectly for you. Because the machine, you know, now if you get the machine, you're going to have to get the cleaning uh, machine for it. All together, you know, with your insurance, I don't know, it's probably going to be about 500 bucks. Now, to me, it's not worth it. I had all that. Before I had the, uh, the cleaning part, I just had the machine. And then I didn't know that, hey, if you don't keep this thing clean, you can get lung infections. You can get all kind of problems. And a lot of us don't even think twice to clean the tube. We're just, you know, ready to go to sleep, put the thing on. You got to clean that thing on a daily. Now, you can get the machine that cleans the tube. Like I said, all together, it's going to be about five, six hundred bucks. Now, if you're the type of person that sleeps on your shoulder, your back, stomach, you can't use the machine. The, the, the tube stops you from being flexible, you know, sleeping any way you want. It's not going to work. Your best bet is go to Walmart for $2 or whatever. They got these earbuds. Now, these are the green ones. These are probably some of the best ones that I think. I don't, you know, I don't care about the headset. These are the best. Now, when you get them at Walmart, they come with a piece of string on them. Now, what you do is, you see how this tail's sticking out? Now, if you give this to your wife or your girlfriend, she can put these in her ear, but she's not gonna be able to do it with the tail sticking out. Now, what I've done was, I clipped all that off. So, you see how small it is? This will fit in her ear, and you can even clip this part off, this, the, this third ring, you can clip that off and make it even smaller, and just have the two little rings on top. She can put that in her ear comfortably and she can sleep and will not hear your snoring. My wife is attest to this. Um, I, snore like a, I snore like a damn freight train. My wife cannot hear me anymore. She puts, her, um, she puts the earbuds in and she's good to go. She can sleep. She, puts her, uh, she has her phone on. She puts her phone on vibrate and then she has the little light mechanism. You know how you, if you, you can have your phone go off and, and so she has the little light pointed toward her. So when it's time for her to get up, she can see the flashing light. And sometimes she can, she can feel the vibration. But she gets a good night's sleep. And guess what? I'm getting a good night's sleep, whether I snore or not. You know, a lot of people try to tell you, oh, if you snore, man, you, you're going to die early. Look, man, everything has to do with genetics. You know, get your body tested. Go to the doctor. Check your heart out. There's all kinds of things you can do. Now, in my family, the, the fathers and the men and all that or whatever, they live a long time. My dad is 76 years old. He's been snoring since he was like 25. I mean, come on. So, you know, but like I said, don't get the mouthpiece. Don't do it. Take that thing out your mouth. If you got a shotgun and you can shoot in your backyard, throw it up in the air and, and put some lead in it. I'm telling you, it's no good. They don't want to tell you that your jaw is going to be offset. And I care about humanity. I care about people. I don't want people walking around here with the jaw offset and, and talking with a lisp. Mess up your whole social life. All right? So. Jesus this dog. All right, YouTube, I'm out. This lady almost hit me. I'm, I'm on the road and she doesn't know how to drive. All right, y'all. Peace out.